Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to JPTV. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you're all having a wonderful day so far. Today, I thought I would sit down and do a quick five minute makeup tutorial. Um, this is what I came up with, with the Jaclyn Hill Times Morphe Divine Neutrals Palette. Um, you'll see I talk a little bit about it in my video, but um, Jaclyn Hill's got a really bad rap with her some of her Morphe collabs and also her own makeup line. And so I wanted to just test this one out and see um, in my next video, I'm thinking about doing seven looks with it because it's such a beautiful palette. You can go from day to night. So yeah, um, if you want to see how I got this look, go ahead and um, keep watching. And then if you are new here to my channel, thank you so much for coming. And if you um, like what you see, please subscribe and click that notification bell and we'll see you in a minute. Bye. All right, so as you can see, I've already done all of my face makeup. I really wanted to make this as quick as possible. Um, we're going to be trying out the Jaclyn Hill Divine Neutrals palette, and I'm going to let you guys know if it's worth it or not for a quick, easy makeup look. I have tried it before, but I thought today we would go more into looking at what can we do with this particular palette that's super quick and glam. So I'm just going to show you guys what it looks like. This is the palette. So beautiful neutrals, amazing shimmers, and we're going to stick very much in the soft um, area because this is more of a daytime look, especially for someone who's working. All right, so um, I'm just going to go in with Just Barely, and I'm actually going to mix it with this one. So to start out, I usually like to just uh, mix those two shades so it's like super light. And then I build it up. And really you just want to, depending on if you have a hooded eye, the higher you go. Um, if you don't, you can just do a little bit right above the crease. I just really wanted to go for, I'm actually wearing pink today. So I just wanted to go for like a soft, quick pink because I'm actually, I do have another YouTube channel. I've talked about that before where um, I do a lot of cooking. Um, I'm doing the ketogenic diet. So it's a... Uh, low carb, high fat, moderate protein diet. So if you're interested in that, I'll link my channel below so you can go check it out. But um, I'm also filming this morning, um, I'm doing a three day egg fast. And so um, as soon as I'm done here, I'm gonna be filming um, what I make for breakfast. So, and then I'm just gonna darken it up slightly with good vibes right here. So um, I do have to say this, I don't know if any of you follow um, Jaclyn Hill, but um, she's just gotten a lot of backlash the last few years since she, uh, starting with her uh, brand, um, her first launch was her lipsticks and you know, those got a really bad rap. Um, but her palettes with Morphe, Morphe I wanna kinda talk about that because um, this is a palette she did with Morphe. And again, her palettes with Morphe, I think her first one, you know, got excellent reviews and, you know, people, you know, loved that palette. But everything after that, like she did um, a vault palette with them of everything that didn't go in her original palette. And so um, those just didn't do very well. So when trying this one out, I think a lot of people were just very leery of like, you know, just how it's gonna come out. And I just, I don't know, I like Jacqueline a lot. I feel like, I don't know, when you do become, you know, famous like her, you know, a lot of people have their their thoughts and comments and I just feel like, you know, you're a human being. Let's be considerate of one another. She's not perfect. She never will be. And just because she puts herself out there on YouTube doesn't give people the right, it's my opinion, to bash her, so. I really like her and I really like this palette. So see how nice and soft it is. I'm just gonna go ahead and just blend it out with the original two shades. Just kind of go over it one more time. And then I'm gonna pop a shimmer on the lid and I'm gonna call it a day. Like that's how quick this is gonna be. Okay, so I'm just looking in my my mirror to see if I like the build up. Yeah, I think it looks nice. So now I'm just gonna go in with this very pinky, um, shimmer shade it's called all lux i'm just gonna use my finger i feel like these shimmer shades just go on better with your finger 
So, but um, I never bought any of the vault palettes. I only had her original one, which I love so much. Um, so, but this one, I mean, no fallout. And I love Morphe products. They're so affordable. I think this palette was $18 or it's regularly $18, but I actually got it on sale for, I think I paid like $10 for it. Like I seriously lucked out. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more just so it gets a little bit too subtle. Like I really like more of a, a bang with my eye looks, but I know that's not the case with everybody that every, you know, most people just like something simple. So guys, really, that's all I'm gonna do. And um, yeah, it's really pretty. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on, I'll just finish up my eyes. I'm gonna use my um, Epic Ink Liner by NYX. I'm actually going to use my mirror because it's really hard to film and put on eyeliner. I just feel like this is easier. So just put my mirror down low so you guys don't see it. But um, yeah, so, you know, my impressions of this palette is quick, easy to use. And then, you know what I might do is my next one. I might do more looks with it. Like I'm even thinking doing like seven looks or five looks with this palette. You know, like a daytime to nighttime. I mean, because there's just so many beautiful shimmers in the palette that I haven't even used. Like, my favorite is actually Risque Business, this beautiful red brown. But I honestly, besides the one that's on my lid right now, I haven't really used any other ones. So let me know if you guys would like to see a seven looks with this palette. And I will definitely do that. Right, let me just do the wing. And let me just say this, I will never do a wing eyeliner tutorial. Like <laughs> wings are not my strength, especially this eye. Like I feel like this eye is just my weak eye. I don't know if it's because of the hand I have to use to do it, but it just never works. All right, so eyeliner's done, and I'm just gonna put on some mascara. So I have two favorite drugstore mascaras. I talked about it in my drugstore favorites video. Um, this is L'Oreal Luminous Lash Paradise. And then I also, I, I like this one. It's like my second favorite. My first favorite would be the Essence. Um, it's like, it's green, the Essence Lash Princess. I feel like it just works better on my eyes. And look, I got some fallout right here. Oh, you know why? Because I have a whole bunch of stuff all over my hands. Just clean off my hands real quick. And this will happen when you're trying to get a quick look. If you look at I got some right there on my cheek. I'm just going to kind of take that off. I'm right there. And then what I'll do is I'll just kind of like brush back over my cheek with the bronzer that I used. And I actually haven't even put on highlighter yet. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put on my mascara. But yeah, quick and easy guys. I mean, we're seven minutes in here. Um, now obviously it takes a little bit longer because you gotta put on your face makeup. But the actual eyeshadow look, you know what you could do? Like if it's like a Saturday uh, or even, you know, you're, on, you're gonna go to work and you're not gonna see, you know, any customers or anything or you're working from home. You could actually just use like a tinted moisturizer instead of full foundation. Um, and that'll make the, the eye, you know, the routine a lot quicker. Look at, I even got more there. How did I get so much all over my face? What happened today? It's called life, right? This happens to us and we just move on and work with it. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Sometimes when I do like a bold liner like this, I won't even put a lower lash. I won't even put um, mascara on my lower lash. I'm gonna just stop there. So yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I love it. Nice, soft, easy glam look with the Jaclyn Hill Divine Neutrals palette. I think it's worth it, only $18. Um, you can keep looking around too. You might catch it on sale like I did. It was random, it was during like a holiday. I think it was like, let's see, I probably got it. It was probably Labor Day because I think about September of last year is when I probably got it. So thanks again for coming. I'm so glad that you decided to 
watch my video today. And if you liked it, please subscribe and click that notification bell. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.